Curious Mercenaries, Proxy Ninjas, and Pop Culture PhDs. Thank you for your patience for those uh, who may have been interacting with any of our content and noticed it completely went nowhere and then popped back on. So technology is being butthead tonight. Uh, I tried to get everything up and running and then a couple of the platforms didn't want to respond. So I then had to restart everything. So I don't know what the deal is, but it looks like we're green across the board at the moment. So I hope everybody's doing well out there. So it's a Monday. Yeah, usually the least favorite day of the week, but we're here for the virtual destruction in case you need a vent or just want to socialize because this is the EMP Rec Room where we focus on games that involve strategy, stealth, sandboxes, and shenanigans. So that way um, it's the vanilla casual console experience. Um, nothing too crazy going on here. So, uh, if you haven't been around in a few days, or maybe a week or so, those things will look a little different. Um, definitely a lot less for me to talk about now, because I'm going to let the visuals on screen do the talking, and then that way we can jump right into the action. So, there's also some other things going on schedule-wise, which are not listed, but um, this could, this week or next, uh, it's hard to know when, could be last for evening streams, and we're going to end up moving the friday night outing probably to sunday and then any after hour streams are probably gonna end up being during the day um but definitely less frequently because i gotta still use that time for firewall protocol progress um but you know thankfully because of some uh goof ups i was kind of forced to move forward on finally getting hyperstream 2.0 done so we're pretty much close to being done with that i've got uh studio e all updated i've got the uh you know icons all different for uh the different game covers the the good thing about that is it was taking me way too much time to bake a new one the other format was cool and it was good for its time but i mean i definitely need to keep it simpler so i can just basically throw a new cover in there and then just update it so that's ready to go and then of course um all the layouts differ on this side. And I finally did some adjustments to MechWarrior for its uh, screen um, edge. So hopefully that'll be finally be fixed tonight. In addition to um, very similar layout to something I had last night, um, but I actually tried to improve the borders a little bit more. So hopefully there's a little less screen clipping. Um, and then by the time we get to the, the weekly outing, I actually did something for the, the classic games, which are not coming in at a full HD resolution. I actually compress them so they're gonna be closer to their native resolution i mean it's gonna leave a little space on the sides but at least it won't be stretched out so trying to do as much as i can to improve the experience because we're not like a full retro stream we're not a competitive stream so all i can do is do my best to add value through style and commentary so that's what we're going for um but yeah i also got all the the cool stuff down for the ticker now and i do have some updates i'm gonna do to that but uh, for the most part that's ready to go um i'll start it work on some style things for that so we're back on uh mech warrior uh, we did that last night and uh, that's you know i'm just kind of play catch up to keep making progress because some of these games are really long or you should be at the tail end of the the rosal dlc but we're running into these challenging missions with no opportunity to get our mechs repaired so I dubbed this operation spatula because we're essentially running up the hill with a, a butter knife a stick, maybe a couple matches, and uh, we're going to probably get crushed. I have one of two options. I can either run up the hill with uh, a lightweight mech, which I normally can hold my own on, but because the enemy has such firepower against us, it's probably not going to work out so well. So the next alternative is, is going to try to match as much weight as we can, but 
Um, we're still going to be so underpowered, it's going to be very difficult. Now, I did get a sneak peek, and I saw that the game will throw us a couple bot uh, pilots, but I don't know if that's any guarantee that we're going to be able to hold our own. So I don't know what's going to happen here. This could be the night of trial and error, or uh, hopefully not a complete abandonment of the campaign at this point, just because we're outmatched. So uh could go either way but uh not looking good for the home team we're gonna see what happens and just still try to make some progress yeah because i always forget i don't have a promo thing for it don't forget to hit the like share follow subscribe red pills and all that stuff and uh Definitely make sure you're following because that way you'll see when we're doing stuff after the new schedule change when that does come down. Alright, so this autosave mission is probably the test that I did. I think we're technically starting off here with a save from last night. I don't know if we've seen this one in the cutscenes yet. I think it would have remarked. It's kind of the, the Yamato or something like that, which is um, interestingly a samurai style mech and it's got a katana. It's, it's closer to heavy or assault mech, so I have not bought one yet on any of my prior playthroughs. I'd really like to try one to see if having like a big mech with the, the melee weapon is all that effective. Because really, we've only had the Hatchet Man, which is kind of like a slight um, or a light mech. Alright, so we left off with not good situation here with most of our mechs needing repairs. And even if we wanted to outfit a heavier mech, we couldn't even change the the weapons without running into a time issue. So our heaviest mech that's going to be available is either going to be the Cyclops or the Crusader. Um, and that doesn't leave much else to work with. I mean, I may have to run in with a Blackjack or the Dragon. And we can't really change much for weapons. So let's see what's got the heaviest armor here. So that's got armor to it below firepower. Rifleman weak on firepower. Assassin's definitely not going to be very good, nor is the Panther. Trebuchet finally getting up there a little bit, but again, usually that doesn't hold its own very well. Dragon's not outfitted very well. Blackjack has got armor, but I probably don't have the heavy... Well, I've got some decent machine guns on it, but... Ooh, and I got some... Yeah, I, I guess I don't have this outfitted for the bots. Zeus is in deep doo-doo. So, we still got 40 mil in the bank. So, we can probably buy another mech, but the thing is, it, it's going to be with whatever vanilla stuff it's got. So, that leaves us with Black Knight, Catapult, another Grasshopper, which we already have. Um, Highlander's a 90. Be reluctant to spend another 12 just yet. Two Orions, those are different variants. Not the Phoenix Hawk. Stalker, maybe. This is probably the, the most appealing one so far. Lots of missiles, lots of lasers. No jump jets. Thunderbolt's only a 65. If I were going 65, I'd probably do the catapult. I don't want, you know, saying before, I don't want another Warhammer. But kind of limited on options here. So it's either going to 75 to 70 range or jump up into the 90, pay more. So it might be just a matter of winging it for the first attempt to see how close we get. So maybe what I'll do is I'll grab the stalker. I'll pilot the stalker, I think. And then we'll see how the bots do with the other stuff because it's going to be pretty weak. As far as our uh, performance. I 
Definitely want some extra damage coverage. Try to get some salvage in there. Oh, they're not giving us the airstrike option, are they? That's the other thing I was going to see if possible to try to get that as a cheat, but they're not even giving us the option. So much for that idea. Alright, pilots are ready to go. Next, not so much. So, there's the stalker. I think, that, yeah, so Cyclops is our next heaviest. That's going to be ready to... Uh, let's take a look at the details here. So that has missiles and has lasers, but Captain Morgan there is not as strong on lasers compared to, say, Serena here. It's a little bit more balanced. Yeah, let's give him the Cicada. Or not the Cicada, the Crusader. Yes, D's definitely, yeah, so let's put him in something more missile-heavy, less laser machine gun. We have her, the Cyclops. If I can find it again. And Bugs Bunny over here is going to get... He's strong on ballistics, I just haven't, I haven't really outfit much for ballistics, so... I think he's going to end up with a dragon or something here, because that's probably the next heavy. It's either dragon or trebuchet. Trebuchet's lighter, though. I think he's going to have to go with a dragon. Which... Yeah, I don't think his piling is going to matter. I don't have anybody that's higher ranked other than Van Dyke, who's still injured. Got Mahoney. She actually is two points higher than him. She's already a 5, 6, and a 10. So let's try... I think it's a her. Couldn't remember. Alright, so that puts us at 300 out of 360. <laughs> Still 60 points under. And that's because we had to buy another high mech. Even if I were to buy another, the Highlander, that was going to get us another... You know, 25 points maybe to go from a 65 to a 90. Or, um, yeah, 30 points if we go from the Dragon to the Highlander. This one can't go any higher, so. Alright, so we'll treat that as what we're going in with, and I'll save it before we go. Just in the event we want to try to roll this back without resetting everything. Twenty-six. Likelihood of multiple tries here. All right. Nothing else to see here. Let's do this. Of course, additional concerns include multi-part nature to the mission. So, I, after kind of watching the replay, it made better sense of the, the whole Ronin thing. They were actually declaring 
this Karita fellow who is trying to prevent the separation of Rosal Hag. Um, Quit your wailing. The second sort of light is House Corita's premier unit. The poster boys of the entire DCMS and duty bound by their strict Bushido code to hold order. <laughs> they even throw Bushido into it. They need to put our faith in their reputation to uphold Theodore Corita's orders to bring the rookie to justice. That's a big risk, Christian. Um so yeah, the the parts of House Corita that are the opposition were declared Ronin. I thought it was the other way around, as if the Rosal Hag stuff was the one being declared um, Ronin, which seemed kind of weird. So we're actually fighting the Ronin aspect, and we're in, in the quest for independence allied with the Bushido-esque, the honorable warrior proper, with the proper portion of House Karita. So... I don't know, it's kind of interesting that they tried to throw that in there, but... Enemy spotted. Not sure if it isn't without a degree of cheese. We could stand up here on the hill. Ooh, I need to check weapon groups here since I'm using something new. Alright, so lasers two, or lasers going on one. Evac Kate's over on Twitch. How you doing? I'm doing well, thanks. Are you a uh, mech warrior enthusiast or a uh, random passerby? <laughs> All right, so I think I want short range on two. Ooh, man, this has got... How many groups we got here? We still got four groups. I should be able to pull this off. I, oh, there's no arms anyway. Oh, thanks. So you fa found by lurking, huh? Well, um... Yeah, I've been, I've been putting a lot of effort into the custom stuff, so I guess you'd have to be a little bit more specific on what, what you're talking about. All right, so let's put the large lasers on three, and I guess we'll go long-range missiles on four, which it already is. Uh, I do not have a Discord. there's any other profile or a uh, way to send it via direct message or something but I've, I've usually got my links in my past video streams so unless there's any other platform that matches that's I, I don't know what else to say at the moment oh almost had a shot at that one. Oh, he's coming too close he ain't waiting around losing stuff for already. Ooh, heat's a problem already. Not good. This armor holds. Serena is going to get wrecked. Let's try to figure out who to take out first here. Yeah, 
critical for us. Oh boy. Oh, why are they picking on me? Oh, there's my stuff. This is not, I'm um, <laughs> all running around wingless over here. I sure don't. Fire game, I'm gonna blow up. They claim that he is dead at the hands of a Lyran Loki agent. Loki? That's hard to believe. Mirabok, stand down. Taisho, we'll allow you to take your Ronin into custody, but I want proof that Marcus Kurita is dead. Let's arrange for a joint debrief. Hey, Ovesta. I'll see that it is done. Alright, so. Well, Serena ain't dead. That's a good thing. Still have this mech, but man, is it broken. Company of Rec Room. Ugh, I got seven mil. How much is it gonna cost us for repair, though? Wow. Well, it's chewed up all of the damage coverage, plus an extra mil, but at least there's enough of a payout. Ooh, some goodies. Okay, well, this is good. We're gonna need some of this stuff. Let's 
surprised we actually finished that. Okay, we're going to take the large laser. We're going to take the level 4 laser. Let's get one of these AC2s and one of these if we can afford it. And then is there anything else? Level 2 lasers, we've got a few. Probably lost a couple in this whole fight, but... Yeah, I guess we'll take one of the twos. Oh, no injury. That's good. How much time we got to repair before they throw us out here again? Oh, they verified. Clown is dead. Dead clown is dead clown. We'll never know the real story. Of course not. It wasn't written into the script. <laughs> So for now, repair and refit for next deployment. I'll have more information where we headed once I report. Okay, great. So we're we are still stuck in this vacuum. <laughs> great. And there's we now have another stalker. So that was the I don't know if that was the one to, to buy or not. So view transmissions. Okay, so this is interesting. So this pertains to the giant merger I've mentioned between the giant blue and the giant orange ones that are diagonal from each other. So we can. This is actually interesting. That's a twelve. So probably a little more, more difficult. We're not touching it yet. Um, but what's our timeline here? So if we depart now, the mission. It's not telling us when the mission is. Uh, that's potentially dangerous. I mean, all we can do is then get stuff repaired. I'm going to cost a lot of money. Oh, okay, so we'll arrive in 53 days. Yikes. That still leaves the Grasshopper, the Atlas, the Zeus, all out of commission, the Hunchback. To <laughs> like, they're not being very nice here. Still in 39 mil, which is good, but um, let me do another save. Alright, now let's look at our disastrous repairs here. Man. So yeah, the only ones that are going to be ready to go here are four days and six days of Zeus and the Warhammer. Alright, there's 111,000. So 271,000. This thing's missing stuff, which is going to cost us two. 400k, this hurts. The mercenary wallet is extremely pained by this situation. 600k, and take two thirds of the year to get it done. Uh, not pretty. Well, I guess it gave us another stalker and a replacement, but man, this is not cool. Um, so we might as well see with 55 days on the clock, see if there's anything that's going to be doable that we can at least. Hmm. We're uh, we're not going to be able to intermittently run the clock down because once we do, we can't do anything while departing and flying, so it's going to end up putting us our next stop. So even if we're going to try to address weapon upgrades, it's already going to be at the fifty-five mark. Not like we can get some done while en route. Um, poof. So the stalker is really the only thing we can even upgrade here if we set it up. 
ahead of time. So it's got some SRM-6. I mean, I can maybe put some better lasers on it since we've got some twos to work with. But given the difficulty we're up against, this is increased the risk of them getting broken. All right, SRM sixes. What's our uh, situation here? We can maybe drop the fours with some higher ratings, but I'm not sure for ooh twos. We've only got two of them. Hmm. Okay. How about this ten or actually large lasers? I know we were already pretty light on. We've got a couple threes more. Yeah, no twos at all. Hmm. Well, actually, you know what we can do? Rather than using the large lasers, maybe... Yeah, actually, you know what? Here's a plan. So the lighter lasers take up less weight. You can reallocate that toward armor. Yeah, that gives us another four, four tons. So they're not going to have them all running on the same thing. Throw some extra heat sinks in here. Oh my goodness, look at the amount of heat sinks already on this thing. Uh, we can just, might as well justify using a couple doubles. Uh, so let's get rid of one and one and throw doubles on here. So the doubles, even though it's a double heat sink, it takes up a th three spot. Um, so that should help cooling, even though we're using mediums. The missiles do generate a lot of heat as well. Oh, this is posted at 34 days. So long we can get. Ooh. I gotta be careful here. I wasn't even watching the clock. Oh, this this already might be too much. Eighty-five days. Yeah, I'm overdoing it here. Died, gun it. All right, let's just switch to two lasers and see what happens. See how much time that's gonna put us at. Eight days times three is 24, 12 times three is 36, 16, that's 48 days just to switch that out. I think that's all we're going to do for now. It's got plenty of heat sinks. 40 days. Uh, try doing one of the lasers. Twenty two sixty six, that's gonna put it over. Can't do it. Alright, so there's back to sixteen. So that's as good as we got for now. Okay. I think the next best thing we can do is roll out. Um, let's see if there's anything left to buy here that I didn't catch. Ooh, ooh that's kind of nice. There's only one. Got the money. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Level three lasers. Yes, please. And machine guns. And we're on twos. Smalls. Alright. And uh, yeah, so it's the same mech selection we've already reasonably exhausted. Alright, we're flying out of here. 53 days. The Dragon's Breath. Goodensburg. There's a 
rare banshee. Ooh, cantina. Finally get some stuff in here. And it's got a hiccup there. Collect one Jenner. Let's see if we have that one Jenner. Kill six fire stars. Man, that would have been nice to have already. Kill five assassins. Might as well add both of those. We could always get rid of them later. They're smaller mechs, so the chance of seeing them is a little bit more common since than some of the others we've taken. Alright, let's see what kind of mechs we have in cold storage here. Do we have that specific Jenner? JR7O, JR7P. I don't think either of those are the qualifying ones. JR7D, of course not. Okay. Um. So, are we still in the same situation here? Uh, they basically threw a 97 Banshee out there. Man, it's only got three weapon slots. That's just crazy. I mean, it's got armor. And he's like, you better might as well just throw the max things you got on there. There's a couple awesomes. I don't know why they're awesome. Looks like they're made by Amazon. <laughs> uh, Alright. Ooh. Ooh. More lasers. Making my day here. Oh yeah, literally. Oh, I'm not buying the wrong stuff. Oops. Take the four. What about smalls? Yeah, we'll take all your smalls. It keeps putting me on the next one down. Keep buying some garbage. Alright, maybe you want to sell some stuff. So anything in the low category that we have plenty in the higher category. So that's around six. We got twos, ones, threes, fours. So if we got enough ones, we don't need the zeros. That's around fours. I'm gonna get rid of one zero. Two streams, not a whole lot. Plus, we got a distinction with the Artemis Force. That's around twos. Got a lot of twos, so we can probably get rid of at least some of the ones. I don't use the burst lasers. And kind of the high chem lasers. I'll hang on to them for now. We got enough. Five PPC or level one PPCs that I don't use much. Let me get rid of the zeros. Pulse laser I don't use. Not much on the medium rifles as backup yet. Knuckles and claws. Okay, so for machine guns we have five fours, seventeen ones, three twos. All right, I can get rid of the zeros. Burst laser. Not much. All right, so we got 53 level ones. Yeah, we can get rid of all 33 of these zeros. Oh no. Ah. Find time to crash. Okay, uh, stand by for a sec. I might as well, since that's gonna reboot, I gotta take care of something here. And I finally have my standby screen working.
Go figure technology. It's been working against me all day. Or at least not all day. Just this evening. Let's see how much I have to... Hopefully I don't have to redo too much. Just have to go back into the store, hopefully. All right, so silly mission. Now it's having a conniption fit. Okay. All right, so I didn't quite get to the AC f tens and stuff. It's a lot. There's a little five. Don't really use the flamers. Large laser. There's a three. Need some twos though. And we'll get a couple ones. Around ten. Oh, okay. So we want that. We want that. Don't buy the zero this time. Save us the trouble. We'll take the machine gun. We'll take the small lasers. Three small lasers, laser, and leave the rest of that. Try to sell stuff if I can do it without breaking it again. Okay, so yeah, the tier zero sixes here. The fours. First laser. Okay, so twos we got 11, singles we got 18, so we can get rid of these. And then I think it was, we had like 33 or something I went a little too crazy on. I'll try to leave that alone, at least not sell so many. The zero machine guns can go. And it's probably the medium lasers, right? Level one. Oh yeah, has these. So we're just gonna get rid of thirteen of these. We'll leave the rest. Okay, leave that alone. We already looked at the max. Oh good, it's Modoc. He's back. Ready, sir. Let's get to work. All right. We'll lay you down, Commander. I've trained for this. Uh, this guy looks like he wants to go into training for World, World War II pilot. We're going to leave him alone. <laughs> He's the only one high rank out there anyway. Most of our pilots are fine. So, at least as good as we can get. 43. We got some older ones that are really going to need to go here. Man, McCarty's probably going to go at some point here. Mansfield's got the same helmet as a Serena, I think. Yeah, so we can probably get rid of Mansfield here. Once we get clear of this, because I don't want to drop anybody right now. Okay. And I think we're going to... Oh, let's, let me make sure I can get the stuff rearranged here, because all the stuff's getting repaired. So, let's put our stalker... Up in this spot where the other one is. What else is in healthy condition? <laughs> Which is not much. Uh, let's probably put our Warhammer up there. Ew, what's going on here? Change slot. Okay, what else is healthy? Not much. Oh, we got a Zeus. Okay, so we got 60, this is what, an 80, 
140, 210, 295. We're still hurting. You got 34 million. Option to buy like a 90. Um, Grasshopper's two days. Let's see how long the mission is because we don't know if we got anything following this mission. Zero days. Interestingly, this is a destruction one. There is a possibility I might be able to zip through here with a, a fire starter. And that way we might preserve something. I haven't bought any new mechs. And I haven't changed the pilots. So if I do save over our ex most recent one, we're not in the worst shape in the world here. And I may attempt to run in with a fire starter and let everybody else take the three heaviest. We'll at least preserve something like the dragon. Alright. So again, Operation Spatula. Run in with a rusty spoon. Alright. Alright, we'll go for three. Salvage is working out pretty well since we got some decent salvage coming in finally. In the form of weapons instead of mechs. The mission okay. area is under heavy weather warning. It's going to affect visibility. Yeah, and yeah, we don't sensors. care about visibility. Just keep shooting until it's all dead. Okay, Morgan, you're gonna get Captain Morgan and the Stalker. Don't mess it up, pal. Serena, yeah, you were not doing so hot in whatever the thing you were piloting last time. Let's see here. Maybe put you in the Zeus. Mahoney. I guess, yeah, the dragon was our next most powerful thing. <laughs> so, yeah, we're down 35 points because I'm taking something light. I can take something heavier. What else do we have? Only other option is the Warhammer. Actually, let's put her in the Warhammer. The dragon's not doing us a lot of good anyway. It's got some machine guns, some lasers. Okay. Double lasers. Double lasers. Large lasers. Okay. All right, yeah, we're down 100 points. We'll see how this goes. It's a simple question of weight ratios. Stand clear. Pretend it's a roller coaster. He almost like make up. What on earth does that even mean? Against other supplemental targets, weakening Kelswat's grip on Gunsberg. We shouldn't be wasting our time with this. Those marks have taken store to a city. Christian, my family. They don't know. You haven't been able to make contact with them. But we can't blindly rush into Kelswat's stronghold. Especially when Ronin forces are also in system attempting to take Gunsberg for themselves. Ooh, a few at us. This is the place. Level it all to the ground. Leave nothing for them to use. What do we have here? Mail starter and a band of turncoats. Target. 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 
Alright, so I might be able to leverage my speed here if I can stay away from these things, but... Ah, stand on top of the turret. Let the other guys deal with it. Listen, you look like you're wearing, like, a PSVR in your head. You probably don't have a whole lot of authority over there. Kelswa. You're a virtual commander. All I'm hearing is blah, blah, blah. I can't hear you above the sound of me shooting your stuff into the ground. <laughs> shooting down the buildings. Shut your mouth, Captain. hag. Even as a fictional character, I've got words for you that I won't say. <laughs> you bitch. Oh, probably he's gonna say it. Come and try. I'll be waiting. Uh, she's gonna find herself in a hole in the ground. I've got you, Commander. Or a malfunctioning mech. Angry Papa Bear Tor coming after you. Him and his big helmet. It's the battle of the big helms. Seven mil. That's kind of nice. We're gonna need it for the damage everybody else took. Ugh, they didn't give us much to work with, mostly because it was a destruction mission. So I got the two mil coverage, and they still took three on account of the other damage. Bleh. I guess we'll take whatever we can get out of this. Ugh, those guys are both in the hospital. Look, I'm running around a fire starter. I took Nick no damage. You guys getting your stuff wrecked. What do I pay you for? Captain Morgan drinking on the job and Mahoney doing who knows what over here. Take it out of your pay. Alright, timeline. Mission start, 14 days. The Grasshopper and the Atlas will be back online. Good. Everything else? Not so much. Ugh, they're going to be in the hospital for like a month and a half. 
crazy. Oh, I forgot. Well, I guess I wasn't shooting a whole lot anyway. I forgot to add these other uh, jobs. All right, let's get repairs started here. Look at this. Look at all this stuff you guys got wrecked. Some nice quality level 2 medium lasers. Taking it out of your pay. Did you lose all the lasers I just put on here? Yeah, basically. So he just drained us all the level 2 lasers we had left. We had a surplus. Ugh. Means the Zeus is just doing a single swap here. Look at these guys. I only need, four, I only need twelve days for mine. What's wrong with you? All right, we're still in the plus. We were at like thirty-five million. We're still plus five for future repairs, which are bound to happen. Given the way these Cracker Jacks are operating their machinery. Oh, well, this is interesting. So this, the Crusader here, I don't know if in the past episode I was remarking how the fist thing is not showing. Apparently it does in the charred state. Only when its paint job is in the default full working condition is it kind of got the 3D normal mapping issue. Alright. Time for another save. I'm trying to do this without spending money on the Banshee or anything here. So I guess the the overall missions haven't felt quite as dramatic as uh, Castro Lancer, but it feels like it's kind of going a little bit longer, at least in the quantity of missions. Crispy stalker leg. All right. Tonnage limit four hundred, so we're finally at max, max level here, and we still can't field that. Well, we might be go closer to at least having the Atlas operational again. All right, we need even more damage coverage. Well. Don't want to keep spending too many points on that. We're getting some other good stuff out of this. What was our mission type? Campaign. So who knows what this is going to look like. Yeah, let's get the extra damage coverage this time. Well... My grasshopper running again. Oh, it's gonna be missing stuff if it is. Price to miss. Oh, it's missing the large and a medium laser now. That's not cool. Um, grasshoppers two days. Well, that, that, that laser should be fine, though, by the time it's done. Uh, technically could run down the clock here. Alright, let's make sure that's done. Looks like it is. Okay, it's back in working order. Good. Um... All right, change pilots. I'm gonna have to use Junior Ding Dong here. Uh, is Van Dyke back in action? She is good. Can we put her in the Atlas, or is she gonna wreck it? That's a single laser to replace. That should be fine. Does <laughs> not give her much firepower at all. Surprisingly, Serena's still operational. Both stalkers were a problem. It's not good. I think. Oh, we didn't. 
thought we kept the Warhammer available. Guess not. Two Zeus's in the, in the thing. Where's the other Warhammer at? Oh, I'm only rolling one Warhammer. Yikes. Man, we got the... Oh, is this the other one? storage here and get it repaired once time permits. Yeah, we gotta bring this other Warhammer out. Do we have any other heavies? No, we got a Centurion and that's it. Oh, we got the Cataphract. What was this all about? The 70? Not a fan, but might have to. I got enough time to outfit this thing. Hmm. I could take the fire starter. I don't want to give one of the bots the grasshopper. Because they're going to wreck my weaponry on there. Well, Mahoney's got to get switched out. Who else is healthy? We can pull out Bugs Bunny or... this Bugs Bunny time. Oh, Whitmore hasn't done a whole lot, but his, his weapons are really low. Bugs Bunny's a better shape for uh, being competitive. This feels like this is the most strategic part. <laughs> Figuring out how badly going to crash and burn. Um, Rifleman's got Ballistics and lasers. He's not strong on lasers, but he could make the ballistics work, especially at level two. Wow, 110 points under. I think, yeah, I'll just have to go 290. The only other option is me to try to put the grasshopper in competent hands and then roll into the fire starter since I can use it halfway effectively. forget my cool line of the rec room where we keep, keep our ketchup next to the katanas and my visuals now reflect that. Well, I've got ketchup on the table and I've got katanas in the background. So it's closer. Long narrow canyon, so they can get more time yakking at you. Literally, 
just gonna throw stuff overhead that's pinging at us. They just wanted a scenic tour of North Country. Look at all these cool glaciers. Waterfall. I am still outpacing <laughs> half of uh, our others back there, especially that Atlas being so slow. It's almost make, maybe makes sense to let them catch up a little here. Oh, you, oh, I was gonna say you sent <laughs> sent in a panther. stepped on. Ooh, there we go. That Wolverine. Yep, that's a Wolverine. Funny, I was letting you know. Oh, Tori gonna be mad. You said we shouldn't. You are to screen over the Lieutenant Mirabog and his detachment withdrawal. They need you. Respectfully, you will say that's not going to happen. We're not getting paid to throw our lives away just to preserve yours. Our thoughts and prayers are with you. Just a block. He's peacing out. Dragon's breath. Dragon's breath. Respond. Damn it. They've cut off communications. Well, that's an extent we can't get to. They're happy to take our money, only to throw it to the wolves. Oh, we need it? No, don't you dare say anything, Christian. This isn't the first time Magnuson's mercenaries have breached their contract on this war and left our people to die. They're only here so they can rob us blind when we need their help the most. Sir, the 211th are withdrawing from the west and collapsing on 
working on it. Uh, I don't know what to put in our way. Kind of holding up. Given the next mission to be back to back, I can be able to repair this stuff. You don't have to be hunchback. Like an idiot, so I keep shooting at you, please. You spider get away. Come on. There we go. Enemy mech destroyed. Garbage in. Oh, they're sending two. Ugh. What should we do about all this? Those are both hostiles and we're in trouble. Yep. Yeah, they sent a big one on one side and the lightweights on the other. Still here. So six on eight, six on six. Cross some paths of this thing. I don't really want to. I don't want to say anything yet, but I'm be getting close. Looking at me. Yep, I lost a leg. Up here. Here We're almost done here. Hold out just a little while longer. I don't know about almost. Starting to look a little better. Need some range here. Well, that doesn't have much left. There we go. Me. It's got a zillion other things to shoot at out here. There. Stomp on your corpse. Not with much hardware.
That's a dramatic end. So the campaign still can't be over. Obviously, we're not going to rescue them, but we still got to rescue hostages or prisoners from Tyra. Queen Helmet. I'm person. sorry. I dedicated my life to fighting for the freedom of our people. To build a better home for you to grow up to see. One where you would never live under the boots of House Corita or Steiner. But the great house is disdain for our people. is endless. Magnuson and the Republic were fools to trust that they would recognize our people as equals. Or that the hired guns would care for anything more in lining their pockets with what little wealth our people have. One day, you will learn of all the things Christian and I sacrificed for our people, and of the mercenaries that betrayed us, leaving your mother and I to die at the hands of our oppressors. I'm sorry that their greed and indifference robbed you of a life with us by your side. If by some miracle I survive and live to see you again, I can promise you one thing. I you won't trust will mercenaries make again. Them pay. No. Well, let's hope they uh zombify him somehow so he makes him better villain or antagonist. <laughs> Kinda left the door open on that one. <laughs> so they better give us time to do some repairs if we're going to drag this on any longer because our stuff looks like a bucket of scrap So 12 points gets us a locust and a javelin, neither of which we care about. We care about this large laser, though. Some of these lasers. Not those lasers. Uh, yeah, we want that machine gun. Wow, share cost of five for a level one? That's interesting. All right, might as well take level four here. Yeah, I think we're good on jump jets there. Uh, I guess we'll take the SRM-4. And the PPC for the sake of selling it. Damage cover, 2.6. Damage taken, 1.4. Are you kidding? After all that ripping I got? Well, I guess maybe it wasn't as bad as prior. I mean, I, I took the bulk of the damage. What are the rest of you clowns doing? Well, good thing the Atlas didn't take too much since that's expensive to repair. All right. Oh, so they found him. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Mir is so. Oh. 
Also, is Tor gone or not? I can't tell if the Tor and Mirborg are two different characters or what. Okay, good. So he's planning on doing a reestablishment before attacking her. He's like, good, because we can't do anything. All right, and they gave us a Cyclops. That helps. Okay, so what's the timeline? Mission start 15 days. Fantastic. So that's like no time to repair anything. So, the, okay, Zeus's will be operational. Crusader will be operational. New Cyclops. Everything else, not so much. Good grief. Okay, we got 46. Let's see what it will look like after repairs. Alright, that's not too much of a problem. No problem there. Crispy, but no problem. Alright, so that's, yeah, the one mil plus. So within 15 days we'll have the Crusader, Zeus, Dragon, Zeus, Rifleman, but everything else. So we'll have a Cyclops, Crusader, and two Zeuses. We'll have a little bit, but not, not anything I would consider extensive. It's costing us three mil per quarter now. Time for another save. So I'm surprised he wants to go in after this, like, after just saying, like, yeah, we got nothing. Yeah, he's calling it a Hail Mary. Okay. Uh, still no airstrike support. What's up with that? Um, let's go one extra... On the salvage, see if we can't get more cool weapons again. So, Grasshopper, not an option. I guess I may have to take the new Cyclops, probably. Uh, where is it? Both stalkers in the shop. Warhammer. Did he not? Oh, they. What they do? Give us a broken one? Cyclops, Cyclops. Oh, one's in the shop. <laughs> he gave us a broken Cyclops. You gotta be kidding me. So we don't have a Cyclops. <laughs> it's got no legs. Brilliant. Yeah, this thing. No kidding. It's gotta be repaired. 25 days at 1.7 million. Unbelievable. Okay. Scratch that. I may be taking the fire starter. Check, I'm gonna have to check the timeline. So timeline said Crusader Zeus uh, Zeus's Crusader and Zeus's. Okay. So who gets the Crusader? Bugs Bunny again? 
Yeah, we'll do that. And then these two will get the Zeuses. The Zeuses. Getting leases. And give her the heavier one, and give her the lighter one. Yeah, 200 or 140 points under. My only other option would be underpowered Centurion or a Trebuchet. Uh, yeah, in a Warhammer that's got no ammo or no weapons attached. Yeah, I, I really don't have any other options. Okay. Let's see what happens. Otherwise, we're going to have... Um, Operation Spork next, because we will run, have run out of pointy sticks and spoons. After weeks of fighting, Nicole Kelswa's forces appear to have gotten the upper hand over the Ronin, forcing them to retreat to the Bavaria Mountains. Kelswa has fully mobilized the Gutudomerung society, looking to crush the remaining Ronin before they can fortify their position in the mountains, before she undoubtedly pivots to hunt us down. But we won't give that monster the opportunity. Our best chance at taking Kelswa out is to slam into her with everything we have while her forces are committed to finishing off the Ronin. The battle ahead will not be easy, but it's a fight we must win. Otherwise, Gunsberg will be lost to the same monsters that murdered our families and nearly killed Oberstleutnant Miraborg. Move out and destroy them all. Yeah, well, if you're giving me two max, that With might help, three but... separate armies fighting a must-win scenario, this mission will likely devolve into absolute chaos. Yep. To get through this, you'll need to sit close and support the first tier mechs accompanying you on this mission. Yes. Pick your targets carefully, and do not draw too much attention to yourself. Otherwise, you could find yourself simultaneously targeted by both Steiner and Carita of Fours. She's cocky. Equal opportunity dirt bag, huh? Back here, I don't want to get shot in the back by. <laughs> Great, we got more break dancing mechs going on here. So, do we not want to shoot this thing or is it secondary? You are. It wouldn't be that easy. Okay, well, 
least did their job there for once. Yeah, giant box cannon. I'm sure this is going to be a good time. I want the bots. Doing wide circles. One more to my kill count. Ooh, I lost a couple lasers. Could be my good ones too. Oh, that's a lot of lasers. To that thing. Ouch! That did a lot of damage. This is smelling like a redo next time. Oh, toast. Man, my fire starter got shredded with all the goodies. We'll see how much more is after this, because otherwise, we're in trouble. that close. Oh, no. Nope, it's not that still, uh, what's her face, probably. No, is that her? First fire's pretty cool. Yeah, that's all it is. 
Oop, there's still another one behind me too. Missiles left, just lasers. I guess they're not too interested in me. So <laughs> I ran away. Shocker. Fuck's playing doing the whole time. He's not even taking any hits. Oh, there she is. Ah, oh, done. All right, that's the end of that. There's one and a half mechs left. Oh, less than one mech left. Okay, that's the end. Um. Alright, so I'm going to save that. It could be next week. I don't know what, again, mid midweek schedule is going to look like here. So, Zoigs. Okay, well, thank you to those who've been lurking, watching, hanging out. Um, yeah, Twitch, I don't know if actually serious or just trying to hawk something so i hope you're legit but either way i mentioned i don't have discord so i don't know what to tell you <laughs> so um yeah don't forget to hit the like share follow subscribes red pills and uh tomorrow being tuesday good chance of still pulling off some xcom i hope to have some more updates on the overlays here um and then otherwise um can't think of much else for news. Yeah, hit, um, don't forget about checking out the Firewall Protocol Saga. The link will be in the outro. And I think that'll do it for now. Oh, hey, Maven. You just popped in the last second here. <laughs> Hope you're doing well. So thanks for stopping by. Sorry it's, uh, if, if you were already lurking for a while, I um, hate to cut short on you. <laughs> but I've already been out for a couple hours. So, um. Okie dokie. So I hope everybody has a good one, and I'll be back on tomorrow night for some XCOM. So catch everybody later.